Samsung, Samsung laptop. The Moranga County Senator was at Kiagudu Boys High School during a prize giving ceremony for the students who excelled in last year's KCSC. The stalemate triggered by the supremacy contest between the two chambers of parliament dominated, with the Senate Deputy Speaker faulting his colleague lawmakers in the National Assembly for allegedly trying to stifle devolution. Anybody who not, does not support devolution at this stage, in my, in, my, in my humble estimation, that person doesn't have the interest of this great country at heart. The National Assembly had on Wednesday disregarded the amendments agreed on by the Senators on the Division of Revenue Bill when it was forwarded to them by the National Assembly for their input as required by the Constitution. The National Assembly had initially allocated 210 billion shillings to the county governments, but the Senators increased their allocation by 48 billion shillings only for the National Assembly to disregard the increment. I would like to tell them with a lot of humility that what they are doing is an act in futility. Because if that bill is assented to the way it is, it is going to be, in my view, my very, very strong and considered view, an, an unconstitutional bill and or act of parliament. Disregarding the Senate's amendments according to Gitura was out of step. The Speaker of the National Assembly, all he needed to have done is, that, is to tell us, we don't agree with the amendments that you have proposed as Senate, therefore, under Article 112 of the, of the Constitution, we are going to have to create a mediation bill, a mediation committee of equal numbers between the Senate and the National Assembly to look at the bill again, you know, and come up with a middle of the way, an agreement on the way forward on that issue. The issue and the solution was not to ignore what Senate had said. You cannot wish Senate away. It's a waste of time to try to wish Senate away. The supremacy duel between the two houses has been cited as an obstacle to devolution, and the Deputy Speaker is proposing a ceasefire. There is no supremacy battle at all, at all. That is in the figment of the imagination of certain people. But even assuming there was, and I'd say there isn't, should we make the Kenyan suffer by failing to do what we are supposed to do? If the division, if the division of revenue bill is not passed, then it means that devolution is going to be very gravely affected. The Division of Revenue Bill has been forwarded to the President for assent. The bill is critical in giving the legal authority for sharing of the 2013-2014 budget between the national government and the 47 county governments. Francis Gashori, Citizen, at one.